What's up, guys? Scruggs92 here. FIFA Tips on Facebook, FIFA Tips HD on YouTube. And today I'm going to show you guys a video of me buying some packs because I got over a million coins, so I figured that I'd buy some packs, show you guys what I get. This is during happy hour, which means that there's about double the chance that I get an informed player, which you'll see in the video that I actually do get an informed guy. So here we go. All right, see there you can see I have the million coins up there. Six trophies, not too bad. All right, first pack, 15,000. This is all the packs that I buy. I've got all 15,000 ones. So let's see what we get. And what do you know? Nothing. I know a lot of you guys always open packs and you're always like, oh man, hopefully I'm going to get a Messi or something or a Ronaldo. And then always, it's nothing. So this is one of, this is a pretty normal pack. Uh, I put some of these consumables in, but I cut it out and then I just discarded the rest for a couple thousand. So next pack, I think in this pack I get something pretty good, we'll see. Yep, uh, team of the year, Inform Baines. He's a uh, left back on Everton. He's only worth about, uh, probably about forty-five to fifty thousand. So it's a pretty good, pretty good player. But in the long run, from buying packs, you're gonna realize that it's just uh, not smart. Probably the worst thing you can do on Ultimate Team is buying packs. All right, next pack. Let's see. Oh yeah, this is this is actually a decent pack. I actually got pretty lucky in a lot of these packs. So you'll see in a minute who the good players that I got might surprise you a little bit. Oh, here I was looking. I don't know what I was doing here, but whatever. All right. So see on the all the way on the left, that's uh, 74 overall Davies. He's in the MLS DC United. He's 90 pace and he goes for about 7,000 striker. So uh, that was definitely a pretty good player, but that pack was a negative profit. So that is not a good thing. Let's see what we get in this pack. And looks like nothing again. Barcelona kit. Oh, Bastos, not too bad. What is he? He's probably worth like one to two thousand. I'm not exactly sure. A lot of these contracts and stuff, I just send in my consumables to use them. Kut, he's all right. Netherlands, Liverpool. And next pack. Let's see anything in this pack. I think I might get one other good player, but I'm not exactly sure. And is that a Messi? Oh, of course not. <laughs> it's a Benzema. But uh, some shiny contracts, a rare badge, rare kit. That's a waste of seven rares. That is another horrible pack. This video is, uh, this definitely proves that buying packs is the worst thing you can do on Ultimate Team. I know when a lot of people, they get 7,500 coins or 15,000 or 25,000, you guys just waste it on packs. And that is something that I do not do. I never, I, this is probably the first time I've bought packs in about a month or something. And that's how I have so many coins because I just never do. So yeah, that was another bad pack. Let's see about this one. And... Oh, what do you know? Another horrible pack. <laughs> Alright, oh, yeah, some squad morales. Yeah. So, uh... Oh, what's going on here? Something on the video is not. 
Oh, I'm looking up how much informed Baines goes for. I edited this. Pretty sure it's about 40, some, 40 to 50,000. Yeah, there's one 50,000. Yep. All right, yeah, guys, and uh, I'm just checking how much my Baines is going to go for. 20,000. I actually ended up bidding on that one, but I didn't win it. And uh, Spawny, he did the same thing here. He actually wasted about 100,000 on packs, and he had the same result where he got nothing. So, uh, yeah, he actually got uh, Snyder, but that's only about 25,000. So, uh, the only way to profit from packs, which uh, I'm sure a lot of you guys know, it's called the bronze pack method. You just buy the 400 pack, and then you put everything in the pack up for 200 by it now. Which actually, uh, you can put, you can actually put players up for 150 by it now. I'm sure a lot of people don't know that because there's only about maybe 30 pages of 150 by it now players. So, um, but if in the 400 bronze packs, if you get like some make contracts can go for like 150 or 200, and then the healing cards those go for about 250. So those are pretty easy to make profits on, and that is honestly the only way to make a profit from buying packs. So uh, if you guys like this video, maybe leave a comment of the best player you've gotten a pack. That'd be pretty cool, I guess. And uh, that's all for today. Uh, take it easy, guys. See you later.